Hello, and today we're going to be playing the Thousand Week Reich again, because the last one got picked up by the algorithm, and I, of course, want to be repeating this. But I will not be playing uh, Germany this time. No, 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 no. I will be playing the one and only, obviously the best country in the mod, Banat. What? Why, yes, I am playing Banat. This, this region of the world has been taken over by the SS, and so, of course, we're going to have to be playing as them. Hopefully do some fun stuff. Uh, after the formation of the Serbian High Command, the region of Yugoslav Banat has been under uh, German m minority regime. Nice. Forwards. All right. So, got bandits, aristocracy, press natives, and colonial uh, repression. But we do have a focus tree. So, we're going to have to probably go down this. Now, I imagine, yup, that we have a little bit of time before Hitler dies and we break away. So, for now, let's... <laughs> Let's just just build some some STGs. <laughs> we only have what two factories, and we're supposed to do some crazy stuff. So this this might be a bit difficult. We do have two divisions. So one of them is a tank division. One of them is a mountaineer, and they they don't appear to be that bad. And of course, Beria is dead. It, I I'd show you all the events, but I showed a, a lot in the previous video. But um. <laughs> Yeah, just, there's so many events, mostly from India, Indonesia, it, oh my god. I'm pleased to announce we have two military factories now, so that's not all that bad. At least our leader's happy. I would not be happy right now, because not only is it an SS state, but um, yeah, I just, I don't think, I don't think the country, the country's in a good spot right now. Oh, well, it looks like we're going to win this, uh, this border war here. No, we're not going to win this border war here. Eh, it doesn't matter. It was worth a shot. But yep, if I unpause the game, I bet I'm not even going to go a week without getting a slew of... Yep, yep. Oh, uh, we got a bit of a problem. In that in that border uh, war, The o <laughs> my only civilian factory got damaged, so now I can't, I can't even repair that single civilian factory. What, what, right now, what I'm doing, I'm trying to get... A, um, before I do all this, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to go to, I'm going to do this, but before I do that, I'm going to get a good military out. Yeah, I'm going to try to invade, Ser uh, what is it, Serbia or Croatia or, yeah, Serbia. Oh, yeah, I got more guys, that's nice. My two, my four men that I was just had, is now went to 4,000, and I'm get oh, yep, that, that might be important. Um, well, Germany got cooed by Manstein. So, I wonder how long that's going to last, especially with, you know, the, uh, the SS. I don't know how that happened, but Romania is now at war with Hungary. Okay, I got a good feeling about this. Oh! Well, that's lucky of us, so that we get to do the fun stuff, but, uh, not good for the entire German populace. There it is. So, my GDP is bigger than Nova Sub Iraq, Vietnam, Nepal, Morocco. Well, huh. <laughs> that's, that's actually just kind of funny and stupid at the same time. Oh, and yes, we are in the middle of just <laughs> tearing apart families. Oh. Well, good for you, Czechoslovakia. Let's see if you can, uh, you can, you can manage to do something. I don't, I don't have high hopes for you. Oh, how'd I win that? Well, we won something for once. Go Banat. Finally, we get to realize the situation we're in. Bypass that, and of course, not do the cringe stuff, but we stand alone. Oh, <laughs> Manstein got cooed uh, by Speedle. So, maybe that wasn't the smartest decision to do, because you're kind of losing the war to Goring, but you know what? There you go. Be proud in our illegitimate state of Banat. Our forward-thinking German bride. Classic German way, we're now going to kind of defunct historical claims to justify our conquest. Oh, and the, uh, People's Germany have popped up. Oh, <laughs> just, just in Berlin. <laughs> just, just in Berlin. Yep, that's, <laughs> that's gonna go well for you. All right. Well, let's finally, uh, end it and start going on a little bit of an exterior conquest. I don't know how well I'm gonna do. I imagine pretty badly. Oh, well. That might be a serious hindrance to my plans. Oh. Yep. Uh. They did it. <laughs> oh. 
That... <laughs> it actually changed the whole thing. It's just now the remains of a city. Oh, well, I now have plenty of war goals on a lot of people. Of course, I don't exactly have the military to back this up just yet, but uh, I'm working on it. So I looked away for a hot minute while I was trying to do my own stuff. Gotta say, that's a pretty big Denmark. I'm just minding my own business, planning my plot to encircle the entire Hungarian army, and... Germany can't keep in one piece. I really hope they don't go all ham on me. I should probably save here. You know, the clock's kind of ticking. Um, the entirety of Europe has essentially been, uh, liberated. And I believe that America can now start to liberate the rest of Europe. So, obviously we're going to have to beat them to it. Let's see how well we do. Okay, okay, uh, okay. Let them r ram it, ram their heads into us really quickly. Yes, yeah, yeah, okay, okay, okay. So, let's try to quickly move to prevent any crazy stuff from happening. Kind of fan out. That'd be great. Yeah, yeah, oh my god. That went extremely quickly with militia and poorly equipped SS divisions. Yeah, look at that, look at that. All right. They are, they are finally getting demolished. Come on. Oh yes, there we go. Okay, hold on. I got a, I got a good feeling about this breakthrough. Especially because we have a tank division. Wait for us to win this battle. If I win this battle, hopefully I'll be able to... Come on. Yes. Okay. Boom! We just took... Oh, okay. That's... And then we can cut the country in half. Yes. There we go. This is basically us winning the war now. Hopefully they're at least bombing them. Yeah. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I'm actually very surprised that I was able to complete this. That I was able to uh, win this war. As banana. Okay, um, I am, I swear to, I swear on my soul, I did not cheat that. <laughs> At least I'm able to take it, because all the uh, allies did was just aerial bombing. <laughs> yeah, look at, aha, the greater Dan, Danu Schwaben, I'm butchering that so bad, Reich is, is it's, com it's coming together. Hold on, Croatia, Serbia here. They are independent. Well, we're going to have to take a slight detour from Hungary to go have a little fun in Serbia. Now that, in any other context, that wouldn't sound very good. Hey, America, I was going to do that. Oh, I, I missed uh, the occupation of Hungary, but I was going to say, wait, what the? What? Okay, now that's just silly. All right, we're partying in Belgrade tonight, boys. I'm going to loot. And, and do other unsavory things. One of those unsavory things is encirclements, apparently. All right, party people in the house tonight because all of Serbia is mine. Okay, well, they were a bit tougher than I thought. Of course, any counter, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm holding, definitely. <laughs> this Croatia war was by far the easiest and the most fun. <laughs> yeah, okay, that was, yeah. And yeah, now we're dealing with the Banat Mafia, yeah. We're above Algeria, Ireland, Armenia, Peru, and, um, Stinky France. Now, Hydric, what are you, what are you doing there? You're not gonna get anywhere. He's not gonna get anywhere, right? I guess Hydric really does think he can do that. And Hydric, stop stealing my thunder. Well, good luck with that. Um, I had to wait a few years, like a, like quite a few years, actually to get to this point, but we, our military has effectively come to terms with the Romanians. And I'm sure, I mean, it isn't the best. I'm, I'm a little bit curious to see what's gonna go on. Come on. Oh, well, that wasn't so bad now, was it? Let me just uh, capitulate the, uh, okay. now that's something. Um, you know, maybe I should rethink this. Apparently, I didn't need to wait. Um, well, that was, that, that was surprising. Hopefully, it'll be able to last a little bit longer. Well, I guess fall back to the river. Okay, uh, one more try. 
Okay, what I failed to adjust for was that I can make whole new divisions, and these, these divisions are not just any old divisions. They are SS divisions, which have more defense and a little bit more training time. I gotta say, one of these guys looks pretty familiar. Get all these guys who happen to be gooning around. Actually, just w w what happens if I do this? Uh huh. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, this- <laughs> none of that this time. Hungary's gone, and I got all the guns too. I got a- I got a very good feeling this time, I can- uh, I can reassure you. I man- I switched around the division, so now they're- they have lots of artillery. And let's see. Huh. I knew it, I knew it. Artillery, and infantry, and a little bit of tank it- tankage. And you got yourself a- well, <laughs> That doesn't really come close to what the numbers I'm taking, but it's still a victory for me. <laughs> uh, pillage borders. <laughs> One of the events you can get is Grand Theft Auto Banat, if you saw that. <laughs> they had very few divisions. Over oh, that's Saudi Arabia, right? Yeah, okay. Anyway, they had very few divisions down here, so I'm just taking advantage of that, and I'm flooding down. And yeah, the, these Hungarian tanks are going all over the place. Oh... We, we still haven't managed to kick them out of Northern Hungary, but we are on our way to take the capital, and that will be a very swift conclusion. Hold on, let me let me try expanding it a little bit. Oh yeah, would you look at, oh, hold on. <laughs> if we can keep a hold of the, oh darn it, hold on, oh, hold on. We almost got it, I swear. Yes, there we go, okay, okay. And they're basically holding in there. Oh. Yeah, they're collapsing up here in the plains. I should, I don't want to take the capital, but eh, there you go. Yeah, at this point I can win. I'm going to have such a large GDP after this. I guess take this last capital is really one of their last victory points, other than over here. And let's just, yeah, finally after so much hard work, uh, yeah, as you can see, my front lines were, uh, yeah, I, I guess I, I wasn't looking, I took the capital. Well, can we now do it? What do I need to take? Bold Grand Theft Auto Banat. But uh, for some reason, I can't, I can't unify the thing. I don't, I don't know. That's pretty odd. Okay, just uh, don't tell me when I use console commands. Prince Prince Ujin marches on. Well, there, there you go. I have finally, I have finally proclaimed the new lands. Was that Banat gameplay fun? Yeah, kinda. I had to do that Romanian war a couple times, but overall, I'd say that was a pretty enjoyable experience. Um, I'm so glad the Allies didn't come and curb stomp me, and I gotta say, this is a really good mod. I do like almost everything in it. Um, just the focus trees are extreme. Wait, cool. Ooh, maybe I'll have to do that. Anyway. Thank you for watching. Um, actually, hold on. I'm going to play for a little bit more. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm pleased to announce the one and only <laughs> GDP, the only, the only country left in the world that could truly feel <laughs> Banat's force. Well, <laughs> oh, God. All right, if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing so you can get notified when I upload my next video. Thanks, and I will see you next time. Es gibt ein Haus in Neu-Berlin, man nennt es Haus Abendrot. Es war der Ruin vieler guter Jungs, von mir mein Gott litt ich Not.